Hello everybody and thank you very much for watching. In this video I would like to share an app with you which allowed me to pinpoint exactly what's taking so much space on my phone and do just like I say spring cleaning. There's a lot of apps which will allow you to find out what, take, what came or app or file taking space in your phone and then you can go and delete the file and everything is fine. Some of the apps uh, will uh, be ad supported, some of them will be paid. Some of them will say that what they do is legit, but actually they just involve a lot of nonsense behind the scenes. The app that I will show you is called Disk Usage. And let me run this app. When you will run this app for the first time, you will be presented with options where, which, uh, which storage unit you would like to scan first. In my case, I have storage card, which is represents internal phone storage and storage slash 71B7 and blah, 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 blah. That is my three terabytes external hard drive, which is currently connected to my DeX. Yours can say storage card, internal or SD card and etc. And if I will connect another hard drive, I will have a third option to, to scan. So I will choose the storage card. And it automatically opens these tiles. Yours will start scanning and I will show you what the scanner would look like. So it's gonna happen like this. It's gonna go and start scanning through your selected storage unit. So we're scanning again my internal storage. Let's wait for this to finish. Come on, come on, come on. And here we go. So right now is I've been presented with the tiles going from the left side as a root folder all the way to the right side to have my fine details of exactly what app, exactly what's using all the way to the most fine data and know exactly what's going on. So let's go back to the main one. So storage 112 uh, gigabytes of our internal storage, apps taking 35.8 gigabytes, media 5.3, system it takes 14.4 and I have 55 gigabytes of free space. So let's go into apps and on the right hand side it starts presenting what apps take in what space. The most storage demanding app currently on my phone is Real Racing Free game. I play this game once or twice a week with the racing wheel, so I'm gonna keep that one here. I'll be an online client. Um, I done a video about this game, I tried it, so technically I don't really need this anymore, so I can actually go in and install it. I This app do not uh, allow you to go and uninstall within this, but as you can see, if I click on the show, it opens this app information. So I can click on install here, click OK, and the app disappears. No auto scan, so sad I will have to rescan again. But let's keep going down the down the down the list. Uh, Raps Rap uh, Raspi Card Manager. Uh, that's Raspi Card Imager. This app allows you to create Raspberry Pi OS on SD cards. I've done a video about it. I don't really need to use this anymore, so I click show, it opens up, I click on install, click OK, and this app disappears. So right now, what I can do, I can go into the scan and try to scan again. Let's wait for all this to scan. As I can see here, it shows a, big, a lot of gibberish, but that's fine, it's just, I'm gonna wait, and here you go, it's scanned, so I have extra four gigabytes of storage available now. Let's go back into the apps and let's see what else I can go and install. So I have Real Racing, Life is Strange, Messenger. I have the cache there, messages. For some reason I have 1.3. I need to dig a bit more uh, into this. Why it's taking so much space. Durango game, that's fine. Life is Strange and so on, so on. Reality Clash and etc, etc. Let's go back. And on the media, I have downloads, which I have Chernobyl, CSGO video I created, movies, basically the videos I created, and Cyberlink, so I can go and start deleting. So this app does not gives you much of features, but I like this tile presentation, because this straight away tells me what is taking so much space, and I can go and directly start solving my storage issue. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.